Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to sell videos on Wix. So I'll be showing you step by step how to create a website that will allow you to sell videos online. The first thing you want to do is go onto Wix.com. Once on Wix.com, you can create an account for completely free. You don't need a credit card or anything like that. All you'll need is your email address and from there you can create an account with a password. Once you have done that, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. And all you'll need to do is tap on create new site in the top right hand corner. After you have tapped on create new site, you will see this pop up which will allow you to use the AI to create a website for you. But for this tutorial, we'll be setting up our website without AI. So let's tap on that. After you have done that, you'll be redirected to this page. And from here, you can type in the type of website that you would like to create. And it doesn't matter what type of website you'd want to create, as there's only one plugin that you'll need to add for you to be able to start selling videos online. So for example, let's say I wanted to create a video website. So I'll simply type in video and I'm going to select video portfolio. Then from there, I'm going to tap on next. After you have tapped on next, you can enter the name for your website. So let's say for example, simple videos. And I'm going to tap on next right there. After you have done that, from here, you can see the different plugins that will be applied to your website. And as I was saying earlier, it doesn't matter the type of website that you selected. All you need to do is select this plugin once you're on this page. And this plugin will allow you to stream videos, sell your videos also. And if you'd like to offer a booking, you can do that. So you could select booking right here. And you can also select forms, which will allow you to get your customers information and collect payments and so on and if you'd like to also offer an online store which you can sell other products you can do that also and if you'd like to sell tickets or so on you can select events now let's select next at the bottom of the page once you select next from here you have three options you can either choose to go to your website dashboard or you can choose to get a custom built site but i would recommend that you tap on begin with a template by selecting begin with a template you will be redirected to the themes page and with wix they will provide you with numerous themes that will make even a complete beginner when it comes on to website creation look like a professional with these type of themes so all you need to do is select a theme of your liking so let's say, for example, I were to select this theme. So I'll tap on edit. Once you have selected edit, you're going to give it a few seconds while the AI composes your website in the background. Once on this page, you have the option to use the AI to create content for your site. So you could type in what your site is about and it will compose different articles that it thinks will work out on your website. But we'll be selecting the X in the top right here. After you have done that, this is your website main dashboard. All you'll need to do now is go over to the left hand menu option. And from there, you can tap on add elements. By tapping on add elements, you will get access to the different elements that you can add to your website. For example, if you would like to add text, you can do that. You can also add images, button, video, anything at all that you want to add to your website. You'll be able to do, any, to do it better. Anything at all that you want to add to your website, you'll be able to do that by tapping on the plus in the top left-hand corner. So once on Wix, the plus in the top left-hand corner will be your best friend. And by scrolling down, you can see how your website looks. And to make any changes, all you have to do is simply hover over the section that you'd like to change. And you could select quick edit to start editing it. And if you'd like to manage the videos, you'll tap on manage videos right there, which more than likely you're going to be selecting. 
so you can upload your own videos. Once you have tapped on that, you're going to be redirected to a new dashboard on which you'll be able to upload your videos. So let's do that real quick. So you can see the dashboard right here. Now it is time to start uploading your videos. And you can see that you'll be able to upload video files of up to 15 gig max. All you'll need to do is tap on upload and from there you can choose whether you'd like to upload it from your computer, Dropbox or Google Drive. Or you simply like to embed videos from YouTube, Vimeo or Facebook. You can do that right here. Another thing that you can also do is by going over to the left hand menu option you can add live streams and channels and so on. You can either choose to upload videos from your computer, Dropbox or Google Drive or you could paste in your video link right here or your channel URL. So let's say I were to paste in a video link right there and then I'll tap on add video. After you have done that, you can see the video has been added right here. And by going over to the left hand menu option, you could also add live streams if you want. And you can add channels as you can see right there. So you can see the video right here. So all I'll need to do is simply tap on it. And you can see set pricing. So I'll tap on that right there. From there, you can select whether it is paid or free. So you can tap on paid. So you can see you can only send videos you uploaded. So because this is a paste, because I paste in the URL, I wouldn't be able to do that. But I'm doing this for example sake. So all you'll need to do now, if you uploaded your own video, which more than likely you would have done, you could tap on pay. From there, you'll be able to select the viewers option and you'll be able to select the download option and you'll also be able to set your price. Once you have done all of that, you'll be able to tap on save and then you'll go over to the left hand menu option and from here you're going to scroll down and you're going to hover over billing and payments. You're going to tap on payments. After you have tapped on payments, you will be redirected to a new dashboard and you're going to tap on manage payment methods. By tapping on manage payment methods, you can set up different payment options that you will offer to your customers. For instance, you can connect your PayPal account, you can also connect TiloPay, and you can add other payment methods by scrolling down. You could tap on see more payment options and you can connect different payment options. And by the way, the payment methods that are available will vary depending on the country or region that you're in. So for instance, if I were to change my location in the top right hand corner, I will see different payment methods. Once you have done all of that, all you'll need to do is tap on the X to go back to the main dashboard. And from here, you could continue editing your website and you'll simply tap on save. After you have tapped on save, you'll be able to select your free Wix domain name and you'll tap on save and continue. Once the changes have been saved, you'll tap on done. Then from there, you could tap on publish in the top right hand corner. But for now, I'm going to tap on preview. And that's it. That's how to create a website using Wix to sell videos. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And thank you for watching.